a recent uh, DVD. 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 I'm the Canadian. Stop my pain and I have a theme song. How you doing? This is Larry Graves, a.k.a. Canadian Stud Muffin, and today I'm going to show you most of my DVDs and Blu-ray discs because a couple of you have asked for me to show them, to show them off. <clears throat> this is a DVD collection of one of my favorite TV shows of all time, The Andy Griffith Show, the complete set. This cost me... $8,200. It's a, uh, no, it didn't. It cost me $5,000. <clears throat> and another complete set is by, it's a Canadian show that some of you Americans might have seen, but it's one of the, uh, one of Canada's favorite comedy shows ever. It's Trailer Park Boys, complete set, and it in includes all of their movies, too. And, uh, I forget their names. But there's Bubbles. He's my favorite. There's Bubbles here with, her, with his cats. And there, there's lots of clips on uh, YouTube with uh, Trailer Park Boys. And there's one with uh, Alex Lifeson of Rush. He was, uh, he is a big fan of Trailer Park Boys. He's in an episode where the Trailer Park Boys kidnap him. And so just look up Trailer Park Boys, Alex Lifeson, and you should be able to see a clip. Or I might leave a link below if I remember. Uh, Axl Rose is a fan, and uh, I'm a fan. So three big stars are fans of Trailer Park Boys. I have shown some of these before when I did like a music DVD thing, but here's everything. ACDC, ACDC Live at River Plate. Excellent. The LEG Show. Both seasons. Really funny. Really funny. Almost as funny as Canadian Stud Muffin videos. Alien Quadrology on DVD. Bachman and Turner, live at the Roseland Ballroom, New York City. It's a recent uh, DVD. 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 Some band called The Beatles, A Hard Day's Night, on DVD. All of these are on DVD. The Beatles Help. The Beatles Yellow Submarine. Uh, the Beatles Anthologies. Uh, the Beatles on the Ed Sullivan Show. Uh, Black Sabbath Paranoid, the story of uh, them making Paranoid. <clears throat> Blazing Saddles. A Christmas Story. Now, I bought this for my sister Sharon, and I don't think she has still watched it. She, she ha you, you have to tell her to watch it because it is one of the, the nice, it's a nice, funny, Christmassy movie. I'm going to cry. <clears throat> Credence Clearwater Revival, the Royal Albert Hall Concert, 1970. Not the greatest quality, but it's a really good concert. Uh, Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young, live at Wembley Stadium. They're all, uh, drugged out of their minds, so they're singing out of tune and everything, but it's still kind of fun and interesting to watch. The Cure, greatest hits. They made a lot of really good videos. Oh, I don't just have music DVDs. Oh, no. Oh, here's another music DVD. Eric Clapton and Steve Winwood live from Madison Square Gardens. Really good. Despic Despicable Me. Really good. I love this, uh... Kind of a horror movie, The Fly, the very first one. This is the uh, special edition. Uh, Frank Zappa, 200 Motels. Really weird. Really not that good. But it stars uh, Frank Zappa, his band members, Ringo Starr, uh, Keith Moon. Some of it's kind of funny. Weird. One of my favorite uh, music videos, concert videos. Concert for George. With Paul McCartney, Eric Clapton, Monty Python, uh, Ringo Starr. Tom Petty, Billy Preston, Jeff Lynn. Really good. John Lennon, 30th Anniversary Edition, Love is All You Need, documentary. <clears throat> Let's Help Them, the song remains the same. And of course, I just ordered uh, their new reunion DVD, or Blu ray, I guess. Another excellent Let's Help Them. Lou Reed, Berlin, live in concert. Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Monty Python, Life of Brian. Monty Python. Monty Python, The Meaning of Life. Which in some ways is my favorite of theirs because it's uh, really weird. I like weird. <laughs> I'm just joking. Paul McCartney, Good Evening, New York City. As CDs enough too. 
Paul McCartney years. Some of his videos on three DVDs. Some drummer named Neil... I guess it's not Pert, is it? Peart? Neil Peart. I used to think it was Pert. It's a three desk about him drumming on all the Rush songs and explaining them. I'm a drummer by trade. And then a comedian. And then a grave digger. Uh, Neil Young, under review. Neil Young in Berlin. That's when he's doing his um, some songs from his trans album, which is kind of synthesizer. He's using a vo vo vocoder on his vocals, and uh, most of the audience is kind of sitting there, kind of like, what the hell? But that's Neil, and it's good. It really is good. It really is good. It really is good, and it's really good. One of my favorite comedies, Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. Look at that. It's 3D. Just like a John Candy 3D thing. Queen, the making of a night at the opera. Queen, Rock, Montreal, and uh, their uh, performance at Live Aid. This one is really good. Queen, live at Wembley Stadium. Queen, it's a documentary, Days of Our Lives. The def definitive documentary on of the world's greatest rock band. Sorry, they're not the greatest rock band. The Beatles are the greatest rock band, followed by uh, U2, possibly, and, of course, Nickelback. Rush, Time Machine. Now, they're one of the best rock bands. Seinfeld, Seasons 1 and 2. That's all I got so far. One of my all-time favorite movies, Sling Blade. Great British band, Small Faces, All or Nothing. It's uh, showing their uh, video... Their, I'll forget it. You don't care anyway. Sparks, live in London. Sparks, DVD. It's a band everybody should listen to. Sparks, Little Beethoven, live in concert. I gotta finish, wrap this up because they're about to arrest me. Another funny comedy, this is Spinal Tap, one of the funniest comedy videos. John Kay and Steppenwolf, a rock and roll odyssey. Very interesting. I like Steppenwolf and John Summer Rental, John Candy. Tell me what your favorite movies are. Leave a comment below him and make sure you like this video. Superman 2. So the video of the special effects don't look as good nowadays. The Three Stooges Collection, Volume 1. Uh, I prefer to have this on Blu-ray someday. Toy Story. I'd like to get all three of them. Toy Story 3. Uh, YouTube Story. Wish you were... The story of the making of Wish You Were Here. Very good. Uh, who Framed Roger Rabbit? And I've got a, uh, about eight uh, YouTube video concert uh, DVDs. Uh, the Who, The Kids Are All Right, special edition. The Who, live at the Isle of Wight. The Who, live at Kilburn, 1977. Guess what I'm going to say. The Who, live in Texas, 1975. I have this uh, 40th anniversary Woodstock, three days of uh, peace and music that was bought for me by my good friend, Gary. Old Vision on YouTube. And in return, I gave him an autograph for only $10. Freddie Mercury, The Great Pretender. I thought this was about his life, but it's mainly about this one album he made with this woman, so you can have it. Frank Zappa, The Torture Never Stops. Very interesting. Produced by George Martin. Of course, the producer for the Beatles and many other acts. Really interesting story. One of my favorite uh, thrillers. The Stepfather, the original one. Fright Night. Lead? No, not Lead Zeppelin. Unleaded. Jimmy Page, Robert Plant. Really good. Especially Cashmere. Machine Head, Deep Purple, The Making of Machine Head. I'm so hip. Then I've got like YouTube box sets that have uh, DVDs with them. Uh, the Dick Cavett Show, John and Yoko Collection. Kind of interesting. I like Yoko Ono.
the Hunger Games on Blu-ray. I haven't watched it yet. I like to watch movies with somebody, but nobody ever comes over to visit. <laughs> Titanic. And it's a good movie, but I actually like the, uh, the special features. Uh, you know, the making of the movies and all that. I find that very interesting. And this is a uh, cat here. This is a three-disc, uh, three-disc disc. One of the greatest movies of all time. No, the worst movie of all time. Plan 9 from Outer Space. Once again, it's got bonus features, but I was disappointed in the uh, commentary. Because the commentary, I thought they would talk about, you know, the movie, and but it's just this kind of comedian guy making trying to make funny comments. But the movie itself is funny, so it's just kind of stupid. I might as well have made the commentary. It was that bad. Another movie I haven't seen yet. Another movie I have not seen yet. The Dictator. It's the L.E.G. guy. And now I want to buy Blu-rays. I don't have as many Blu-rays. 127 hours. That's the guy that uh, gets his hand caught and he ends up having to cut off his foot. Oh, terrible. Austin Powers Collection. All three movies. On VHS. Apollo 13. Back to the Future. All, all three movies. The Cure Trilogy, which my good friend Verno Hester bought for me. He's one of my fans. True fans buy me stuff. Another one of my all-time favorite movies with a great documentary with it and a book. Uh, Deliverance. The Departed. Dub and Dubber, one of the stupidest, stupidest movies ever. <laughs> one of the funniest movies ever. Another movie I haven't seen yet because I'm scared to watch it by myself. Fly Away Home. Kind of a gay movie. I love it. <clears throat> Gone with the Wind. A true classic. My all-time favorite movie, Goodfellas, on Blu-ray. Hugo. Pretty good movie. Lord of the Rings, the whole collection on Blu-ray. Oh. Make a mind. Really good. Just bought this recently, Neil Young Journeys. It's uh, concert footage of him playing in concert just by himself with a guitar, electric guitar, acoustic guitar, and also him going through his hometown of Omimi, Ontario, which I passed by many times. The Omen. Oh. Planet of the Apes. Puss and Bits. Oh. Wrangle with Johnny Depp. Not bad. Another really good documentary. One of the best bands. Canada's best band. Rush. They're such good guys. All three Shrek movies. On Blu-ray. Four, sorry. Four. Uh, Spaceballs, once again with John Candy. Talking Heads, another one that Verno gave to me. Tangled. Actually, a very, very good movie. Another one of my favorites, The Truman Show, with Jeff Carey. Another classic, The Wizard of Oz. And, you know, once again, the movie's great, but I like the documentary crap in them. I think that covers about it all. I've got like a George Harrison box set with a, it's a Blu-ray of uh, Living in the Material World documentary. I've got the Beatles Magical Mystery Tour on uh, Blu-ray DVD. I did a other video for that. And last but not least, more Franks and Beans on Blu-ray. What else could it be? There's something about Mary. One of my top favorite comedies, along with Dumb and Dumber. Sorry it was so long. I've said that before. Sorry if this video was so long, but I've got a lot of DVDs and Blu-rays. Thank you for watching. I'll end it with a smile. A forced smile.